All right, guys, I'm going to be showing you a video of how to make your editing life so much easier and also make your videos pop a little bit more, keep people more engaged in your videos. Okay, the simple way I'm going to show you guys that is how to use Filmora's silent detection tool. It's going to save you so much time editing. Let's go ahead and show you guys that right now. So I have two clips here. One is going to be the intro for this video, and then one is kind of a clip in which I want to trim down uh, the time on it. So you guys can see the audio is pretty spread out here. And so what someone would typically go ahead and do in the past is they'd probably, you know, go to the audio here, clip it this way and then chop it up. So that's, there's not a lot of long pauses in there. Long pauses just mean that people are more likely to clip off your video because it's going to be less entertaining. So people in the past would go ahead and do it that way. Obviously that's not going to be optimal. That's going to take a lot of time to do that. So one thing you can easily do, I'm just going to delete this, drag the clip back in there again. Filmora has a silent detection tool. So you go ahead and click it, click start, export to timeline, and that's how quick it is. And now yes, for longer clip, it'll take a little bit more time, but it is an extremely fast uh, tool. Okay, so here we go. I'm going to show you guys the original clip. And obviously I did this on purpose. I tried to space it out a little bit, but this is stuff that naturally happens in content creation where you had to have to gather your thoughts and come up with something new to say or your next line. Well, this is a great tool where if you just pause, be silent, it's going to be able to help you out a lot. So let's go ahead and show you guys the original clip. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know that you guys enjoy this content and it's content that you guys would like to see more of and that I can produce more content like this. I appreciate you guys watching though and I appreciate your time. All right, so we get the idea there, okay? Very slow, not entertaining at all. So let's go ahead and now watch this clip. It's gonna be much more fast paced. I think I'm gonna enjoy it a lot more. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know that you guys enjoy this content and it's content that you guys would like to see more of and that I can produce more content like this. I appreciate you guys watching though and I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching. I mean, just look how much better that was. It sounded better, it looked better. It was a little bit more engaging with the jump cuts and whatnot. Uh, I created a different camera angle slightly, a different view. Uh, good feeling for the video in general. It keeps people more engaged. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys two simple add-ons to this that you could do to make it a little bit more engaging as well. One simple thing you guys can do is click on this and just pan in a little bit more. Uh, just with the jump cuts in, like zooming in on the camera, people tend to be more engaged with videos like that for some reason with the camera moving and whatnot. It keeps people's eyes focused on the screen more, thus they're gonna be more engaged to the video. So let's go ahead and put this in there. And that's how simple that is. So let's go ahead and watch this clip again. All right, everyone, thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know that you guys enjoy this content. And so another just simple, easy thing you guys can go ahead and do in Filmora to make your video pop a little bit more. So one thing you can do as well is click on the audio clip that you want. And what you can do is change the speech to text. Okay, it's gonna leave the speech in there, but it's gonna add a text onto it. So I'm gonna show you guys just how fast this tool is as well. So it's scanning right now. Now we have the clip processing it. And boom, it's good to go. It's right there in the screen for us. So what you guys will see is that it is white. I don't really like that it's white. I want it to pop up a little bit more. So let's go ahead and double click on it. Go to advanced here, and what you can do is click on it. And I, this is wrong, okay? So I kind of mumble a little bit, obviously not preferred. If you're a smooth talker, this is gonna work better for you, but I'm gonna go ahead and listen to it again, see what I said, and then we can easily change the text here as well. By leaving a like and subscribe, by leaving a like and subscribe, okay? So we're just gonna change this by to buy. And I'm just going to cut this off because, you know, whatever. There we go. And so a simple thing you can do as well is increase the font to make it pop a little bit more. Maybe change it to bold. Uh, change the presentation of it. Make it yellow so it pops a little bit more. And there we go. So let's go ahead and watch this clip one more time. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know. And another simple thing you can do is go ahead and go into stickers. And I already have this pre-saved, but you can go ahead and do the like and subscribe button as well. Bring that in there. That's going to be right here. I'm going to re reduce the size down to this a little bit and put it right in the middle. And now we have a pretty good clip. So I'm going to go ahead and play this out one more time for you guys to see it. And then I'm going to do another 
version of this where I'm going to show you guys just how fast it would be to make this exact clip once again. And I'm going to put a timer up on the screen. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know that you guys enjoy this content and it's content that you guys would like to see more of and that I can produce more content like this. I appreciate you guys watching though and I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching. All right. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and delete this all and we're going to do it all over again just to show you guys how fast this is. Drag the clip down there. Let's go to silence detection. We're going to run it. Click start. Export. There we go. Text to speech here. Okay. Scanning. Now processing. It processed. Now I'm going to go ahead and click this change this to buy once again, just because I already know that's wrong, but move it up a little bit, change it to bold, change the presentation of it to yellow. There we go. And then the last thing I want to do, well, I got two more things to do. We're going to go ahead and crop this. There we go. And then the last thing I want to do is I want to include that sticker. Let's put it right here. Sure. It doesn't really matter where make it a little bit smaller. So it doesn't take up my face. And then boom, we got the clip that we wanted to in a very fast way. And now I got to obviously end the video with that clip. All right, everyone. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this content. If you guys did, let me know by leaving a like and subscribe to the channel. That lets me know that you guys enjoy this content and it's content that you guys would like to see more of and that I can produce more content like this. I appreciate you guys watching though and I appreciate your time. Thanks for watching.